Hey everyone, it's Justin. Thank you for watching and welcome to my house. That's Justin's house. In this video, I have another Utah feature for you and it has to do with Flow Designer and it has to do with stage support within the diagramming view of Flow Designer. Right now up behind me, I've got one of my flows that I use and you can see in this other color here along the side that I've got these stages. Here I'm retrieving a site map, then I'm retrieving the site map parts, then I'm retrieving the Tokyo release notes, right? So we've been able to do this for a while now to create flow stages within our flows so that we can kind of group things together my lesson my takeaway from this was don't put this much stuff into a flow like I did for this particular one it did its job but I'm doing it better with uh, Utah um, but you couldn't do this in the diagramming view that's this one right up here the view changing over to diagram in fact this particular flow I can't even change to diagramming view so um, can't even show you what that is but I made a new flow to demonstrate this okay so here is diagramming view it's kind of got that you know workflow chart uh, Visio kind of look and feel um, and it's moving uh, vertically down and I've got uh, I've got some stages set up here so I went to flow stages and I've got my my stages here one's gonna take two days one day zero days and of course you have all the options that you might want to configure uh, when it's in progress what the state is when it's skipped what the state is and you can change those to tailor them based on what you need but you can also add these to the canvas so I've got this send notification uh, step right here. Maybe I want this to be that second stage of do some awesome stuff. So all I have to do is click this little plus sign in the middle out above that particular action. And now I have this new button in the menu there under uh, action, flow logic, subflow. I have stage. And so now I can pick one of those stages there to do some awesome stuff. And if you look behind my head, there's the the swing out for me configuring the stage properties. I don't want to do anything there. And now I've got two stages represented on the canvas here in, in Diagramming View and Flow Designer. And I had one more stage there, so let's go ahead and add it for when we send that team message. We're gonna do some mind-blowing stuff in that particular stage. So high expectations actually for this flow, but it is a new feature in Utah to be able to work with and manage access and see these stages from within the diagramming view. And that's it, another simple enhancement making Flow Designer even better. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please like, please subscribe, or share it with somebody who you think might be interested in what's new in Utah in experiences like Flow Designer in ServiceNow. And until next time, don't forget to always be learning.